Yo, this your boy Fireworks, and I got my girl White Gold here. This is Snoopers Gonna Snoop YouTube channel, and we're about to go see the new Spider-Man No Way Home on opening weekend. My guy Dizzy is gonna meet us there at the movie theater. So we are just kind of overwhelmed right now. We have been ducking and dodging spoilers like crazy. So we are anxious. We feel all types of ways. We just got done watching the end of Far From Home. And I was telling her that the movie basically picks up as soon as yeah. Far From Home right. ends, right? So we're going to go ahead and catch you guys at the movie theater, all right? See y'all in a minute. Snoopers gonna snip. Snoopers gonna snip. Snoopers gonna snip. It's not your bitch. All right, what do you think? Um, I'm excited. Excited? We're going up. Any predictions? I mean, no. No predictions? No. You have no idea what you're getting yourself into? Not really. All right. I mean, I do, but I don't. All right, you guys, we're here at the movie theater. As you can see, it is packed already. We got the seven o'clock, we're a little early. We're gonna try to get some snacks. We're still waiting on Dizzy. All right, so catch you all on the flip. It's crazy. They just now letting people in. We still waiting on the snacks. Dizzy's here. He had to go downstairs to get his popcorn. <laughs> it's packed. Looks like we're gonna have a good, exciting reaction. We go inside. There's gonna be so many people. It's really good. We're gonna have a good reaction tonight. Looks like. So we just got out of Spider Man. What do you think? It was A1, White Gold, what do you think? It was, was it A1? Yeah, it was good. It was good? All right, you guys. We'll catch you guys at the Korea for the review. Everybody just got out. You feel me? So, woo, we got a lot to talk about. Spoiler alert. All right, you guys. We are finally back at the crib. Got White Gold here with me, you dig? Spider-Man was unbelievable. Holy shit, you guys. Spoiler spoiler alert, okay, before y'all get into this, because I'm not doing no non-spoiler review. I'm going to give you a spoiler review. Holy fuck, okay? I wanted Andrew Garfield and Tony McGuire in there for longer than five minutes. I got it longer than five minutes, bro. And they gave me tons of they gave me tons of content with these guys, okay? Tons of It was really it. good. I loved it. Like, the whole, like, multiverse thing where, like, Doctor Strange did what, like, he did to Spider-Man what the Ancient One did to him. Just, I don't know, that was just one little, it was so good. And William Defoe, bravo, bravo, okay? You brought the Green Goblin to life, to life. I mean, scary Joker level, bro. That's what a Spider-Man, and when we talk about these villains in these movies, a lot of these villains don't get executed correctly. William Defoe, bravo, the most evil villain I've seen possibly since the uh, Joaquin Joker or the um, Thanos or even uh, the Dark Knight. Like, that's a real, real villain in there. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, I love seeing all Jamie in there. Uh, Jamie Foxx did a great trouble. job. Jamie Foxx did a great job as Electro. We still didn't get to figure out how he changed from the comb over and the gap. But the look was way better. The comic book crown look was way better. Um, the the storyline of how it was written, it had to get bad for Spider-Man to be able to become Spider-Man. Those are all of his stories. They show you the lower level of how and the sacrifice and what it takes to become Spider-Man. And this was Tom Holland's movie where he had to do that. And he had help from other Spider-Man. And they really needed him. I mean, I can't lie. Ned doing the, the sorcery, doing the, the mystic arts. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And with um with Tom Holland trying to help everybody and give them like a second chance, I really enjoyed within that, like uh, Andrew Garfield saved Zendaya, which was his kind of second chance from not saving Mary Jane, but he saved MJ. Come on, Gwen Stacy. Yeah, yeah, Gwen Stacy. You feel me? That That moment was good. A lot of people said that they got emotional. I wasn't as emotional as a lot of people was. Um, Endgame still is the most emotional movie I've ever I've ever been in or seen. Um, I had a big big cantaloupe stuck in my throat when Tony Stark passed away uh, in Endgame. Uh, but as far as this movie is concerned, this is a ten out of ten. This is the Spider-Man movie. 
Um, this movie will go down in the history books. Marvel, congratulations, because you have broke history. Um, you got Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, and Tom Holland all in the same movie. They all did do the point. It was just kind of subtle. It wasn't really like, you know, it was really kind of subtle. So I was still excited that we did get that. You know what I'm saying? I did it a couple times. With, you know, but, you know, it wasn't like as major as we wanted. But it was subtle. We, I really. They still put the meme in there. Yeah. They basically still get, let us see the meme. They weren't going to, they weren't not going to do it. You know what I'm saying? They knew they had to. They knew they had to do it. <laughs> and I think it was dope when, uh, when Aunt May passed that she passed on the same knowledge as the other Uncle Ben's did mm -hmm. in the other uh, Spider-Man movies. I think that was dope. And it was also dope to see all three Spidey suits together. I didn't realize how similar that Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield's suit was similar. Uh, and, I mean, uh, Tom Holland's was the, the most opposite. You know, his was kind of darkish navy blue. The other guys were, you know, kind of the blue tone. Um, and at the end of the movie, I thought the last five minutes were really, uh, I was telling my guy Dizzy, uh, when we were waiting on the post credit scenes that Sony demanded the last five minutes. They demanded to see Spider-Man kind of getting into his own groove, getting his own apartment. It's really the kind of only Spider-Man story we got of him in a kind of younger sense. A lot of the, a lot of the other Spider-Man are kind of older other than, uh, Andrew Garfield. He did graduate high school in the uh in the last film so or in his last film but all in all man this was a 10 out of 10 okay we enjoyed ourselves the movie was packed toby Maguire and andrew garfield got uh an applause when we saw them um so you know all i can say is guys go see the movie go see spider-man no way home go see it okay and then on top of that that's just sidebar of spider-man for a second Doctor Strange is going to be a problem. I'm telling you guys. That that little post credit scene with Doctor Strange in it, y'all, that damn near trumped the whole Spider-Man movie. Some of those scenes in that shit, bruh. Doctor Strange easily is going to be the best Marvel movie of next year. I don't know how they're going to top Doctor Strange. We saw Wanda in it. You already know that, uh, <clears throat> not Shuma Giraffe, but I think it's, uh, what's it, what do you call it? What did Dizzy say that the one-eyed monster was going to be? You remember? You don't remember? Okay. We don't remember what the one-eyed monster was going to be, but we did see him in What If, and even we did see e uh, evil Doctor Strange. So Mordo was in it telling him that the worst enemy of the multiverse was the evil Doctor Strange. So there's no telling where that movie is going to go, you guys. Like, all honesty. All right? So, again, we appreciate you guys rocking with us. We had so much fun. All right? So before we get off here, make sure you guys are hitting the like button for us, all right? Make sure you guys are hitting subscribe. We appreciate everything. And make sure you guys are tapping the little notification bell. That way, when we do something just like this, that you guys will get it first, all right? So we appreciate it. We'll catch you guys soon. We got the Matrix coming up uh, next week. So we're going to react to the rest of the trilogy. And then uh, I'm thinking we're going to do a Christmas movie. So you all stay tuned to Snoop is going to Snoop YouTube channel, all right? My name's Fireworks. This is White Gold. And this is Snoop is going to Snoop YouTube channel. And we are. Snoop is going to Snoop. Snoop is going to Snoop. Snoop is going to Snoop. It's not your